tuning in TV land. <laughs> I'm your host tonight, Martha Hood, and we're here tonight with two beautiful ladies. Yeah, so beautiful. Thank you. Thank beautiful. you. And they both are mothers, thank God. Yes. And grandmothers. That's thank right. Mm -hmm. And so am I. Uh -huh. <laughs> we're here tonight. We're talking we're gonna be talking about mothers. Sunday is Mother's Day, yes. this Mother's Day weekend, mm -hmm. and we want to be, uh, our focus is going to be on mothers tonight, and we're asking you all to please watch us, and I know a lot of them are going to call and tell me about it, <laughs> but we're going to get started with Pastor Bruni Mitchell. Now, Pastor, what church you pastor? I'm at Hardaway AME Church okay. in Union Springs. Union Springs, mm -hmm. Alabama. That's right. Okay. And our next guest to my left is Minister Copia. Minister Copia, what church are you familiar with? You with? My husband pastors uh, Jones Chapel AME Church in Omega, Alabama, okay. mm -hmm. which is between Union Springs and Troy. Mm -hmm. And his other charge is... St. James AME Church in Tuskegee on the lakes. Okay, great. I know what that is. Mm -hmm. I know exactly what that is. Yes. And my cousin used to pastor that church. Wow. Joanne oh. used to pastor that Indeed. church. Oh, and that's we right. Was up there to visit with her. I know exactly Dr. what that is. Right. Got to mm -hmm. come to see you. Yeah, mm -hmm. got to come to see you. We're just so happy to have you all tonight. It's a blessing to be seen. It is. It's a blessing really. to be here. It, it really is. is. And it's been a while since we've seen each other. Oh, it has. But God is working everything out for the best. Amen. Yes, he yes. is. Yes. And we're just so happy. So we're here tonight to talk about mothers. Mm -hmm. And what we're going to do, we're going to elaborate on mothers, grandmothers, uh, mothers as a whole. Mm -hmm. Now, Pastor Mitchell, mm -hmm. you're the mother of how many children? Three. Three. Okay, and how old are you? Thirty-nine, thirty, and twenty-nine. Okay. Mm -hmm. God bless you. God yes. How many grands you have? Five. Five grands. Five Thank grands. God for that. Yes. Thank God for that. What about you, Minister Cofield? I have three children. My oldest child is forty-four. My next child is 39, mm -hmm. and my baby is 34. Oh my God, what mm -hmm. a blessing. Mm -hmm. That's a blessing. And I've been knowing both of you a long time. Oh, yes, time. yes. Long, long, long time. Mm -hmm. And I think your son is a minister, right? Yes, he is. He's yes. a pastor. He's a pastor. Okay, mm -hmm. where's he pastor now? He's a pastor of New Bethel AME Church in Newcastle, Pennsylvania. Mm -hmm. My God, what a blessing. Mm -hmm. Are you going to get to see him this Mother's Day? No. You won't. No. But I'm sure you get to talk to him. I'm sure <laughs> you don't call him. Yeah. On Mother's Day, you know, a lot of a lot of people they they rush to the cemetery. Oh yeah. Now they've already started going to that's a lot of mothers of the season. My mother yeah. deceased. Mine too. Mm -hmm. My mother died in two thousand four. Mm -hmm. And your mother died in two thousand four. My dad my mother died in eighty seven. Really? Wow. Two thousand twelve. Mm -hmm. I miss my mom. And oh, I yes. Mom. I know all of us miss yes. our mom. Yes. You know, yeah, what would the world be without a mother? I know. We wouldn't be here. Wouldn't be here. Mother, right? Exactly. Right. we got to have our mother. You're and right. I tell you, I just um, I was asking Chris about his mother. Chris's mother is a dear friend of mine. Oh, okay. She's just as sweet as she can be. Right. Very oh. sweet lady. But I got a lot of ladies that uh, I call mom, I take from my mama's mm -hmm. name. I got a lot of godmothers. Yes. And I thank God for them. Yes. And I'm mm -hmm. sure you all have some godmothers. Oh, too. yes. Okay, well, um, Mr. Cooper, tell us a little bit about yourself. I grew up in Ladonia, Alabama. You know, that's outside of Phoenix City. I remember but that. But I graduated from Central. Yes. So I'm uh, kind of a Ladonia, Phoenix Cityan. <laughs> all mixed up in one. <laughs> um, graduated from Central in 77. I've been married to uh, Reverend John Cofield for 42 years. My so Lord. we'll be 43. My Lord. And um, he's been a pastor for 34 of those years. Thank God. My, Like you said, my son is a pastor. And my daughter is a manager of Journey in the Mall. And my baby, she works for Anthem. So, Wonderful. I have a full life. Yes, mm -hmm. yes. I love uh, doing plays. Um, Reverend Mitchell and myself are cast members. Oh, yeah. Together of one mm -hmm. production. Great. Out of Lumpkin, Georgia. Mm -hmm. But 
We've been in several plays in school, enjoy reading, preaching, singing. My first love in ministry was singing. Mm -hmm. I know that. Mm -hmm. So I, I, I love that. that. And, mm -hmm. and I, you know, and also this month is um, um, National Stroke Survivors Month. May is. And um, Stroke Awareness Month mm -hmm. is what it's called. Mm -hmm. And I've suffered many of those, but to God be the glory, I'm still here. Amen. And I thank God for that. Yes. 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 I thank God for being mm -hmm. here tonight. Amen. Yes, thank God for yes. having you here tonight. I was so glad you answered our call. We called for you. <laughs> and I remember, too, when you was ill. And you don't look like nothing has ever mm -hmm. been wrong with Never. you. You thank look you, real good. Amen. Yeah. I don't look like what I've been through. All Give right. him all the credit. Amen. He deserves every bit of That's it. That's yes. it. Yes, That's yes. Thank it. God for that. Mm -hmm. Okay, Pastor Mitchell. Yes, ma'am. Well, I grew up in both Phoenix City and Columbus. Most people think I graduated from Central because I was always over here with my grandmother. But I actually graduated from Kendrick High School. I'm also a 1977 graduate. Mm -hmm. uh, I attended Colum Columbus College then, Columbus State, it's Columbus State now. And um, I've attended a uh, degree from Apex. Um, School of Theology, and I'm getting ready now to graduate from Liberty University. Um, so, you know, I, I love reading, I love studying, and I like uh, minister, like Reverend Cofield said, that first love was singing. Yes. Uh, that, that was my struggle. I didn't want to, and I remember the late Reverend King, he was my father in the ministry, and he said, Brooke, you can still sing. I said, okay. <laughs> so, you know, but that was it. But um, now I do a lot of plays. Um, we acted as cast members in the plays, and then I walked into the calling. God really had me in, and I began writing. And so I write and act now, and we're on the road a lot with the plays, Birmingham, different places. Then also I'm tending to those grandkids, but you know. <laughs> yes. Kids, honey, I, you love the kids, but it's nothing like the grandkids. Oh, yes, exactly. yes, it's, nothing like, those. Mm -hmm. it's like doing parenting yes. all, over, all again. over again. You know, once you're a parent, you have your small children, you really don't know how to be a parent, true, right? Right. true. But once you have grandchildren, you're already aware and wise mm -hmm. of things that's going on with the children. That's true, that's true. I wouldn't take nothing, me either. I have four uh huh, and I have two girls and two boys. And I wouldn't take nothing for but that little, the youngest girl, <laughs> that's my little heart. Oh. I love her, and she loves her Mimi. She mm -hmm. loves oh. me. She and if, when we call and talk to each other, before she end her conversation, she's going to say, Mimi, I love you. Oh, that's before sweet. Before she end the conversation, she going to, and that just melts. I know, I know. Yes, yes. I know. It's so good to be, you know, be. Be familiar and be with your grandkids, because a lot of grandkids don't. Have, they have grandparents. The grandparents don't have anything to do with. Them. And that's so true. And that's very sad. It is that very. Is so sad. It is. Yes, it is. And they they grow up and they don't they don't know anything about mm -hmm. grandparents. That's true. Right. Well, I want one of you all to tell me something about. Uh, give me a message about mothers. Just just uh, whatever you feel. Just just a message for mothers. Be strong in the word. Mm -hmm. Know the word without a shadow of a doubt. Mm -hmm. Be able to teach your children the word. True. So that they'll know the word. Mothers, please pray with your children. Amen. Amen. Pray with your children. Yes. Because if you don't pray with your children, they don't learn how to communicate with God. Amen. That I, I feel like we have a lost generation because of the young mothers not being able to relate to God, not knowing the scripture, and not knowing how to pray. That's right. Prayer is That's a vital right. thing. Yes. Amen. It's something that we almost teach our children to pray. Mm -hmm. Once they learn to pray, you know, I think about that son, we call him Junior Pastor. <laughs> and when he uh, was, was very small, he was one of Reverend Mitchell's favorites. Oh, yeah. He loves her, and they yes. live very close. Mm -hmm. And um, he would say, 
to me, you know, I'm going to say my prayers before I go to bed. When he was very small, I mean, two and three years old, he wanted to say his prayers. Right. If we can get that environment in homes again. Amen. Right. I really do believe that it'll make a difference. It would. Right. It would. I, I, I believe that. Amen. Because if fathers see the mothers do these things, then they'll, they'll want to do it. Right. Mm -hmm. right. Mm -hmm. You know, I listen to Cliff Rutledge. Mm -hmm. I'm sure everybody Oh, knows. yes. Love him. He says... <clears throat> On Mother's Day, you can't get a word in. Uh huh. People be talking about mothers from near and far. Uh -huh. All the time it's mother this and mother that. He said, but when Father's Day come around. Nothing. He said, they forget Father's. <laughs> they say nothing. have nothing to say and about that's true. Song. They be calling him and play this song for my mother. Do this for my mother. Do they don't never say do nothing for Father's Day. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. And you know, brothers love their children too. Oh, they, they do. do. Sure they they do. do. But it's something about that. Mother. Mother. Mother is mm -hmm. always close, so she's always there with them. The father has to get out and go to work. Those fathers that work. So True. Don't. Right. Mothers, our fathers go leave them, leave them there with the mothers, and they are they are there together. You know, they 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 eat together. Mm -hmm. They sing together. Mm -hmm. They will pray together mm -hmm. with the mother. Mm -hmm. But fathers don't take out much time. With the they That's don't. The mm -hmm. children like mothers. That's right. Now, what do you have to say about that message? Well, to me, a mother, if the mothers would get back to living a life, a life that is pleasing, they should live a life that demonstrates purity in front of their children. You know, I can remember when I was growing up, my mother, my grandmother, they lived a life as a mother. Mm -hmm. Now, I know now there are a lot of young mothers and, you know, they, they are a little different than the way we came up. But children have a tendency of patterning themselves after what they see and if that mother is not living a life a godly life in front of that child and that's why we have so much going on because you got mothers they want to party with children they want to you know and and I, that's something i would never ever think of doing but a mother needs to be a mother figure they need to uh like our reverend cofield said Pray. Let your children see you pray. That's right. Let your children see you That's in the word. Right. Expose right. them to God. And the, the world will get better. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. That's right. And you know, uh, a mother can make a house a home. That's Everybody right. Everybody can have a house. Mm -hmm. But That's it's right. not too many people can say That's a home. That's a different True. house. True. You home. got that right. Mm -hmm. You're going to have to do what you're supposed to do as a right. mother. Right. Right. A lot of children, like you said, a lot of babies raising babies. That's right. A lot of people having uh, women having children at early mm -hmm. ages. Now. That's right. And they don't they don't know how to. Mm -mm. They, they don't know what to do. Mm -mm. But they got to stop and listen and pray. Right. They gotta put God in their life first. That's, That's right. The first thing they need to do is mm -hmm. get, bring God in their life. Then they'll know how to deal with the children. That's right. But a lot of them don't. Take they your don't. children to Sunday school. That's right. Don't send don't them. Send them. Take, Take them mm -hmm. to Sunday school. That's mm -hmm. what we did when we, my mama did when we was growing up. My mama took us to Sunday That's school. right. We mm -hmm. didn't, she didn't send us there. Mm -mm. And church, we had to sit there in church whether we wanted to or not. <laughs> You're right. We had to be there in church. Mm -hmm. And when she gave us, if we get out of order, she yeah. would give us that look. That and look. we knew what that That meant. was it. And we would get ourselves together. Quick. Yes, we would. Mm -hmm. yeah. But children's now, young mothers now, they don't want you to say anything. I know. Children. I know. They really don't. I know. They, they don't want you to, if the children can be running around the and these telephones. Oh, God, yes. These little old six, seven, eight, nine mm -hmm. years, they buying these children's telephones. Mm -hmm. They don't need those. Mm -mm. They mm -mm. don't need those telephones. They're too, that's too young exactly. for phones at that age. It is. Give it them is. something else to do. That's though, right. Because mm -hmm. when we was going to school, we didn't know nothing about a cell phone. You're right. When we got out of school and came home, we came home and we put on our play clothes. Mm -hmm. We didn't play in our school That's clothes. right. Children don't do that anymore. That's right. And we knew to come home before dark. Exactly. Anybody's house to play with exactly. better than home You better. Before dark. That's you right. Know. If they have to call you more than one you time. You in trouble. Honey, I'm telling you. You in trouble. I'm telling you. You in trouble. But a mother is 
something else. It is. A mother, it is. It's, it's good to have a good mother. It is. And it's good to be raised by a mother. A lot of children, like I said, they right. mother died when they were young. That's right. true. And someone else in the family had to, had to raise them. Else. Oh, yeah. And mm -hmm. that made a difference, too. Yes, yes. Um, as a matter of fact, I'm raising one of my grands. Um, it's my son's son, and his mother passed about three years ago. He'll be 14 next month, and mm -hmm. I'm raising him. I'm starting all over again. <laughs> but, um, you know, and it, it's hard when a child loses their mother at a young age. Mm -hmm. Because it's even harder when we lose ours. Oh, oh yes. I mean, you know when they're young. Exactly. Young you know, they're going One through. of my children, mm -hmm. um, my oldest child, right. is adopted. Right. She's actually my niece. Uh -huh. And uh, her mother died when she was 12. Yeah. So I, my husband and I adopted her. We didn't change her name, but we gave her mm -hmm. love and the kindness that she needed. Exactly. And, you know. I, when you were talking about how your mom did with you, Sister Martha, what she did, what Mother did with us, she let us see her read the Bible. Right. She let us see her mm -hmm. kneel down at night and pray. Oh, yes. Mm -hmm. And get the Bible in the morning mm -hmm. before she rose and lay in the bed and mm -hmm. read the Word. Mm -hmm. So she was rooted and grounded in the Word. That's right. She knew the Word. So if she went to church and listened to the sermon, she knew where the preacher was coming from. Right. So she could say, well, amen to the ministry. Mm -hmm. Amen to the word. Exactly. Because she knew the word she for herself. Mm -hmm. And that's what I was saying. Yes. Know the scripture. Amen. And pray. Know mm -hmm. how to pray. Mm -hmm. Teach your children how to pray. Right. That's right. And that way you won't be, it won't be a world of straying. Mm -hmm. You know, they can't, you, you're right. They can't do anything with the children. When they bring them into church with these phones, mm -hmm. They're not paying attention to the no. word of God. Mm -hmm. They're not paying mm -hmm. attention to what's no, going on not. in the no. church. But we allow it. But right. you go to places. There are certain places that your phone is not allowed there. <laughs> You're right. I remember in 2015, I went to the set of The Price is Right. Mm -hmm. They take your phone. Oh, really? They take your phone from you. Mm -hmm. So now we go in the church. <laughs> and we let the children lay on the pew with the phone. Oh, <laughs> with wow. the tablet. And, 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 and play their games and do what they need to do mm. and video things going on in the church. Mm. On the set of the TV, your phone is not there with you. Mm. It's not there with you. Okay. So I, I look at how things are in life now. They're so different when people allow things to happen That's in right. the world, in the church. True. And it shouldn't be so. That's true. Because even Miss Hood could say something to my children. Right. If they were wrong. In That's the right. Line. That's and right. And I wouldn't be offended. Oh, no. But now, mm -hmm. oh, it's a lawsuit <laughs> if you say anything <laughs> to the young children. Right, now. right. It's mm -hmm. a lawsuit. You're right. So, no, ma'am, no yes. thank you. That's uh, right. Just That's pray right. that they get some knowledge. Amen. But That's the TV, right. the radio, well, not so much the radio, the TV, the computer. That's raising it. the children. That's right. And that's right. That's right. That's right. A lot of them raising themselves. <laughs> You're right. Them you are sad. right. Yes, I know when I was working with the school mm -hmm. system, I had a lot of knowledgeable children. Oh, very, yes. Very knowledgeable. Yes. Are. But one thing <clears throat> it stood out with me, I tell everybody, please, mothers, please tell your children, teach your children your full name. Yeah. You would ask the children their names. They didn't know. All they didn't knew was nicknames. Nicknames. You don't do that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Teach your children your full. Because if something happened to them on the street, they, they can't they tell. They can't tell anybody. Mm -hmm. And you give them the address. That's so right. The address. Exactly. Where they live. That's yeah. right. And if you have a telephone, make sure they know that, that telephone number. number. Mm -hmm. They're going to need it. You mm -hmm. don't never know when they're going to need it. You're so right. But you know... Uh, Mothers love their children. I yes, know they do. They yes. love their children, the ones that, that have children. They love their children. Mm -hmm. They don't treat them all the same. I know they don't. Mm -hmm. But they love them anyway. They mm -hmm. still love them. And I've been accused of my parents loving me uh -huh. you know, better than the others. <laughs> but it's not true. Right, it's not right, true. It's right. just different in the children. It part. is. Some children are different. Are different. Mm -hmm. yeah. It is. See, you got to realize that because mothers are full of wisdom. Wisdom, have a lot of wisdom. Yes. A lot of wisdom. Have a lot of strength. Mm -hmm. 
Um, let mother know what her child, she know her child, she know what a child likes. That's right. And she know what her child will do. That's and true. And she know what a child will do. That's right. But I tell you one thing, when that mother fix dinner for those children, <laughs> if they don't eat what she fixed <laughs> back in the day, you wouldn't get nothing You wouldn't get anything right. else. You're right. But nowadays, You're right. if the child don't want what the mother fixed, they're going to go ahead and fix them whatever they want. Or go buy it. Or go buy it. Mm -hmm. right. Or go buy it. Mama, yeah. We had to eat what my whatever she fixed that's back right. in the day. That's right. She and you we had it. to eat as a family. That's right. When it was supper time, that's it was supper time. That's right. Exactly. Yeah. You got mm -hmm. to sit and eat and, and pray together. Just yeah, you, you had to bless your food. Exactly. Children. Yeah. Right. I can remember my daddy saying, girl, you do not sing at the table. These children, now they got the phone at the table. Mm -hmm. They singing at the table, dancing at the table, everything. Mm -hmm. Doing everything. Everything. And they, they, walk in, mm -hmm. they walk in with that phone. Yeah. I wonder if somebody hadn't hit them with a the hug. They're not looking <laughs> They're up. Not, uh -uh. They walk mm -hmm. in with that phone. You're right. Down at that Mm -hmm. And I, I say, now that is bad. That's it wrong. is. It's, it really it's is. Wrong. It's mm -hmm. wrong. You need to take that phone away from them. Give them, give them some time without the phone. Mm -hmm. Take the phone with them. Make them do something constructive. Right. And leave that phone alone for a while. That's right. But uh -uh, the mothers, they don't, well, the young mothers, they, they don't care. They don't they care. Try to, they try to be buddies with the children. You can't, you be your can't children's do buddy. that. You can't be your child's friend. You can't. Mm -mm. You can't. Mm -mm. You can't go. You, you, you mm -mm. go out. You go out to a club, look around, see your child, and now what you gonna do? It's time for you to go. That's right. That's right. You shouldn't have never been in there. Shouldn't have been in there. Exactly. That's mm -mm. right. That's right. Mm -mm. Well, can y'all tell me a little bit about a mother's mission? What is a mother's mission? Hmm. Well, to me, a mother's mission is to make sure that she is setting a pattern mm -hmm. for that child, that she is rearing that child in the right direction. Kind of goes hand in hand with what we said before. Is that a yeah, yeah, but but you know, you, you as a mother, you you do you have a mission. You've got to love that child first wow. because we must understand that God. He, he, well, he doesn't give them to us. He loans us those children, wow. but we are to care for them. Mm -hmm. And a real mother, I think about the story in the Bible about the two mothers and one baby died and the, and the king said, uh, well, I tell you what, we'll cut the baby in half. And the mother said, the real mother said, no, just give it to her. Mm -hmm. That's a mother's love. Exactly. And a real mother has that love. That, that's your number one mission. Mm -hmm. Love, nurturing, making sure that they are on track, on track for God. That That's a, you know, keeping that child clean, making sure they have the food they need, making sure they have shelter. That's a mission. That's right. That's right. And every mother should have a mission. Mm hmm That's right. Mm hmm And should have compassion. Oh, yeah. The children and other people's mm -hmm. children mm -hmm. to have compassion. That's right. Yeah, because a child only learn what you teach them. They don't know. You That's have, right. You have to teach That's them, right. you know. If you don't teach, start when they're young. Right. Start when they're young, start teaching them. Mm -hmm. and, and it will grow up. It will. That's it right. Will. Mm -hmm. will. You got to teach. Mm -hmm. You really have. Yes. I know, um, I love my grandmother, too. I had a mm -hmm. sweet grandmother. My mm -hmm. grandmother. She lived to get 100 years old. Wow. Yes, she did. Yes, she lived to get 100 years old. And I believe it was on an Easter Sunday when she passed away. Wow. Yeah. My mama passed away on a go Good Friday. Oh, wow. Yeah, the day before her birthday. I never shall forget that. My yeah. Lord. And it, it seemed like it was just yesterday sometimes. Mm, I know. It does. I know. It, it does. Mm -hmm. It seemed like it was just yesterday. Yes. But you know, a mother loves her children. She does. All the time. Yes. All the time. Mm -hmm. Is there anything else you all want to say about mother? We, we can talk about that. I can talk about my mama. Mother. <laughs> we can talk about mama yeah, all, all day, day long. long. I can remember. <laughs> I how know. That, that Shirley Caesar said, I remember mother. I re oh, yes. Well, yes. With my mother, uh, my uh, mother raising us, we, we uh, I was talking to with my older sister recently about it. Uh, we grew up in a very unique household. Mm -hmm. We grew up in a house full of women. Mm -hmm. Wow. My father died when I was 10 months. I'm the youngest. Oh. So <laughs> we grew up in a house with nothing but women. Mm -hmm. And it was a very unique house. But mm -hmm. 
the sternness and firmness were there. Mm -hmm. You learned and you right. knew better. Mm -hmm. and, but there were unique things that you learned how to do yes. with them being just women. Mm -hmm. You had to learn how to protect yourself. Mm -hmm. You had to learn how to do different things. Mm -hmm. And it was a joyous life mm -hmm. growing up. We grew up in the country, out mm -hmm. of Ladonia. Mm -hmm. You know, that's country. Right. At that point it was. Right. But to God be the glory, we made it. Mm -hmm. And like your mother, your your grandmother, my mother passed on Easter Sunday. Oh, wow. It was late in the afternoon. Okay. But she passed on Easter my Sunday. My God. Mm -hmm. But she set a standard for us. Mm -hmm. And she taught us how to be real women of God. Right. To walk in righteousness. Right. Yes. And not just be a nobody. That's be right. somebody. Oh, be yes. prideful of who you are. Right. Yes. And let the world see right. that you can be a great person. That's right. Not, you know, and one thing she instilled in her children, and I don't hear people saying this anymore, you're just as good as mm -hmm. anybody. That's but right. But you're not any That's better so than anybody. Than nobody. Exactly. So you yes. are the same God created us mm -hmm. all. And we all have so the same true. intellect. That's, that's true. And walk and act like you are somebody. somebody. Yes. Because yes. you are somebody. You are somebody. Right. That's right. So once you know you are, then your children will see that. That's right. right. I, they'll love their mother. They mm -hmm. But mm -hmm. you have to show them love. Yeah, you can. That's right. You have to show That's them right. Love. And wow. tell them, like you say, your grandmother to tell you that she love you. Mm -hmm. Everybody should end their conversation with "I love you" yes. because we never know when it's when the last time. That's right. That That's right. We That's tell so true. This person. That's right. That is see so you true. Later. That's right. Don't right. say goodbye. It's That's permanent. Right. Mm. That's right. Say I'll see you later. That's, That's right. right. And I love you. Yeah. That's right. Because love is powerful. It's oh, yeah. Love it's very real. powerful. It is. It's and really we is. should show yeah. that more oh, yes. to each other. Mm -hmm. yes. Because we all have our special talents. Yes. And gifts. This is uh, Ms. Martha's gift. It is. It right is. Here. Her calling. Right. It we is. have our own gift. We yes. talk about right. how before we heeded to see our calling, yes. we yes. both yes. wanted to stay in the choir. Oh, yes. <laughs> yes. We didn't mm -hmm. want to go in the pulpit. Mm -hmm. uh -uh. right. We wanted to stay in the choir. <laughs> right. But we had yeah. to do Look what God told us to do. Yes, that's right. And that's the way we should be in front of our children. That's right. right. So that they will be able, they will know who we are and that's, obey us. That's right. That's, That's right. A beautiful thing. That's right. Like I say, show more love. Mm. Because I do love you. And what my mom used to say, I love you, and there's nothing you, you can, can do, do about, about it. it. That's right. <laughs> so <laughs> love each other. That's and right. I really mean it because it's, it's, it's it is. It love is. Love does. Yes. Love is an action, action word. word. That's right. If mm -hmm. you say you love me, you do something for me. That's right. Yes. Show me. Don't show me. Mm -hmm. Don't walk around and say you love mm -hmm. me. And don't do anything That's right. for me. That's right. That's right. That's right. Well, ladies, so much for this. We're going to take a little quick break. Okay. And we're going to be right back in a minute. All right. No, two seconds. Hang on, just stand still. 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 Stand we're back again. Oh, yes. Talking about the same thing, but it's going to be a little bit different from what we can it with. Now we're, <clears throat> we're going to talk about we're, we're mothers. What is a mother? What I mean, we've been talking about mothers. We're going to, we're going to, we're going to, all of us going to sum this up. All right. What is a mother? What do you consider as being a mother? You're a mother. I'm a mother. Right. Mm-hmm. I'm a grandmother. A mother does not necessarily have to be the one that birthed that child. Amen. That's right. Amen. A mother is one that nurtures. A mother is one that loves, provides, that shelters, that's there for that child, Amen. that has that inner love that will just, I mean, take that child and, and, and whatever that child needs, whether it's bloodline or not. A mother does not have to necessarily be the biological Amen. to be a mother. Amen. Amen. That's Amen. true. Amen. Sometimes you marry into motherhood. True. 
marry someone that have children that's true that don't have a living mother that's right. true and you can become the mother of those mm -hmm. children mm -hmm. and take care of those children mm -hmm. and they'll love you just as much as they love their their biological exactly mother. but you have to show what i said earlier right the love that's the it. The love of Christ has to be with you. That's it. You have it. to love Christ first. My and God. Once you love him, you love yourself, then you can love anybody else. That's anybody. right. But you have to love God first. That's Amen. He has to come first in everything. That's right. And once you do that, you, you really will know what being a mother is. That's right. It, it's an awesome thing. Like wow. Like you say, it doesn't necessarily have to be your, you birthing that child. Oh, right? no. You can inherit Children True. and love them just as much. I call it a blended family. <laughs> yes, yes. We have a blended family because my father had two children before he married my mother. Okay. And then, then there are those four of us. So we're blended. You right. know, my brother would say his mama and his mother. Now, my biological mother was his mother. Right. He called her mother. Mm -hmm. He didn't call her mom. Mm -hmm. He called his biological mother mom. Mm -hmm. But wow. he called my mom mother. mother. So that was the distinct between the two. Right. But he loved the both wow. of them. So we love our children. Mm -hmm. And we don't have to have a biological child mm -hmm. to have children. That's true. Wow. You know, they call her the old lady in the shoe. It was a nursery <laughs> ride. She had more children than she knew do what, what to do. do. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's just something about people that show love yes. that children will call you mother. mother. That's true. Now, I know Reverend Mitchell have a lot of children that call, that want to be her children. Yes, Lord. <laughs> so, my children get upset. They say, oh, my goodness, that's not your mother. I know. And they say, yes, it is. So everywhere you go, if you have that mother love, yes, it's going to show. It's gonna it show. is. It That's is. That's right. And children know who you love. Oh, yes. Whether they're your children, they know who they are Yes. Loved. Oh, yes. They Even from a baby, they can tell. Right. They know. My grandbaby, <laughs> it's my little heart, she had a little friend. Uh -huh. And I was taking them somewhere. I don't remember where it was now, but she wanted to sit in the front seat. And the other little girl, her family, uh -huh. she said, well, this is my grandmama's car. You don't sit in the front seat. My grandmama's car. I said, no, that's ugly. You should right. I said, that's your little freak. But she said, Mimi, you my grandmama. You're not her grandmama. You know? Oh, <laughs> Just, my goodness. <laughs> children are so like that. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. She didn't want nobody to take her spot. Wow. Her no, not her place. Uh-uh. Oh. You know, no one. Four of my grandchildren are adults. And um, the youngest grandchild, she's eight. And um, she told them, she said, you know, you all call him Papa. He's my poppy. Uh-oh. <laughs> and you all call her G-Mama. She's not my G mama. She's my jeans. <laughs> now you call her G mama from now on. She's my jeans and only my jeans. She, I have a personal name for her and that's, uh -huh. that's going to be it. Mm -hmm. So, you know, it's funny how these children get possessive. They do. With, well, oh, yes. They feel they belong will. to them. That's true. So, that's mm, right. My God. Okay. Um, ministers, pastor and ministers. And these days and time, a mm -hmm. time like this, oh, you know, wow. we're living in a time we've never seen this My time Lord, before. My Lord, you're right. We've, we've never, but it's in the Bible. It is. It's in the it Bible. Is. It is. Yes. It is. But, uh, let's talk about this this virus. This I know. Wow. Let's hit on that yes. just a little bit. Yes. Yes. That's been mothers. Oh, this is um something that I, in a million years, never thought that we would witness when I first um, heard them talk about the coronavirus I didn't take it seriously you know I thought it was when they were talking about closing the schools and I said nah mm -mm. and when reality hit you know but as a mother and like I tell my well my, my children are grown but my one daughter, she, my daughter is, because um, I only have one daughter, she's with me, she's at the house with me, and I tell my grandkids, you know, this is God's way of 
getting our attention. Yes. God, um, he talks to us always, but the problem is we don't listen. And in and, and this coronavirus, it just continuously takes me to Second Chronicles 7 and 14. Amen. Amen. If my Amen. people, if my he people. don't say their people, he said my, my people. people. So um, what we've got to do, we've got to learn how to take what he says in there. We've got to pray. We got to seek him. We got to turn from our turn, wicked ways. I, I did a sermon a couple of weeks ago called um, Hold Please, I'll Be With You Soon. And I use that text because I said God is letting us know that he's trying to get us to, he's trying to get us prepared. Mm -hmm. He doesn't want to see any of us perish. Right. But right now we're on hold Mm -hmm. until we can pray and seek his face and turn from our wicked ways Amen. and Amen. What, then we'll come off whole because he says then he will hear from heaven and right. heal the land yes. so that's what yes. I'm telling my children you know God is speaking and this is the time that you have got to take it serious mm -hmm. you've got to understand that God is trying to get you to a place because look how many people are dying every day mm -hmm. from this virus God wants us to be right. So when our time comes, we can make it home with him. That's right. That's right. Mm -hmm. That's right. And what you said the name of the sermon? That you it, was thank, it was actually, it was thanks for holding. I'll be with you soon. I'll be with you soon. Just like when you're holding on the is, phone. That's rich. Yeah. That thanks for holding. Deep. Yeah, that's rich. Yes. That, it, it, it has a great meaning. Yes, it yes. Has a mm -hmm. And I do believe God is going to heal this land. I do too. I do too. I do too. I believe he's going to I believe it. Mm -hmm. I really do. Yes. But we got to be right. We got to turn. We got to turn. We got to turn, and that that's, mm -hmm. that, and that's no joke. We've we got, got to. We, we still got a lot of wicked people. Oh, yeah. And they doing in and everything. That's right. Yeah. And they and until they stop. And realize God is God. Amen. He's not gonna heal. He's, he's not. not he's oh not. They're gonna he's have not. To it's so sad. It's sad. It mm. is. It's sad. It's, it's sad. sad. It's sad. It is. It is. But when I first heard about the virus, mm -hmm. I'm gonna tell you, I didn't take it seriously. Mm -mm. I really didn't. I didn't know what was going on. Mm -mm, me either. I didn't take it seriously. Mm -mm. But I kept praying mm -hmm. and I kept listening. That's 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 another key. We need to listen. Listen. We need to stop and listen. Listen. To what's being that's said. right. Amen. And, and 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 open your ears. You'll learn something. You'll that's learn right. Something. And and watch. Mm -hmm. Then he said, watch. As watch. well as pray. As well as pray. That's it. We need to do that. Yes. We need to stop and do that. A lot that's of people it. No, they're not watching. Mm -hmm. Oh no. They're not listening. Mm -hmm. They're doing exactly what they want to do. Exactly. They think it's right. They think it's right. And, and we got to do real prayers. We, you know, we do those quick prayers. Lord, thank you for this. That. Good night. That's it. But, but then when, when something like this happens, oh, we go into deep prayer. I, I remember 9-11 when people oh, prayed that yes. had never prayed before. Oh, yes. The oh, church yes. was packed that Sunday. Three weeks later, yes. you didn't see them. Yes. Yes. But see, this time God is, he, he's, he's getting our attention this time. This one is not going to pass mm -hmm. until we get where we need right. to be. Exactly. Yes. Right. And we're right here in it. We mm -hmm. ain't got nowhere to go. We can't nowhere. hide. We can't hide we can't. from it. And that's where God spoke into my spirit. Yes. Trust. Uh -huh. You have to trust God. Yeah. yeah. You have to have the trust that Daniel had. Oh, yeah. Daniel had a strong trust oh, yeah. in God. Because what did King Darius mm -hmm. tell him? Mm -hmm. He said, if you pray mm -hmm. to, your God, to your God, we're going to throw you in the lion's den. That That's to right. Another God other than mm -hmm. my God. That's right. We're going to throw you in the lion's mm -hmm. den. My Lord. <laughs> So Daniel showed him. He said, okay, I'm going to show you. That's right. My God is the truth. That's and right. God. That's it. And he went in there and he opened the curtain <laughs> and bowed down and he prayed. All he right did not. Now. Yes. Because Daniel had a strong trust mm. in mm -hmm. God. Mm -hmm. We have to have a strong, strong trust, trust in yes. God. And God is going to bring us Amen. Through. He's going to bring us out. That's right. Oh, yes. yes. Oh Come yeah, on about it. it's gonna happen. Oh yeah, yes. but it's yes. gonna be a whole different world. Yes, oh yeah, 
mm -hmm. different world. That's right. Mm -hmm. But we, as women and men of God, we have to tell the people the truth. True. Sugar do what? It decay your teeth. Yeah, right. man. <laughs> you get too much sugar. So you, you can't gain sugarcoat weight. it. You That's can't sugarcoat sugar it. Not too much sugar mm -mm. is not good for anybody. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. What is mm -mm. it? The word cut like a what? Two uh, edged sword. sword. Amen. You got mm -hmm. to be strong. The That's word right. of God say no. It means no. That's it. Without That's a right. shadow of a doubt. Oh That's yes. Right. Daniel was so powerful and strong that what the. Three Hebrew boys, Meshach, Shadrach, and Abednego, uh, all right. knew who Daniel was, they and did. they believed the things that Daniel taught. That's true. Mm -hmm. And so what happened? Mm -hmm. They threw them in the fire furnace, did they not? Mm -hmm. That's okay. We got to stand on the word. We got to know that God's going to That's right. Word. That's Without right. Without a shadow of a doubt. That's right. But you got to know for yourself. That's it. You got and you got to teach it. your people. Or to know for them say right. Amen. Right. Amen. Sugar, like I say, sugar make it you will. gain weight. Sugar decay your teeth. <laughs> like it's that. not good uh, for you. You're right. Something uh, sweet is not always good for you. That's true. Right. You that's gotta right. have a little bitter something. Amen. Lemon is good for you. What they say, take the lemons and make the lemonade. <laughs> lemonade. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, right. I love me some lemonade. That's Sometimes right. you gotta take the lemons and make, make the lemonade. lemonade. That's, that's true. Right. That's, that's a good right. one. You okay. have to trust in God. Right. Like Amen. Amen. Oh, so you got to take the bitter with, with the, the sweet. sweet. That's it. That's right. And That's it's not it. prejudice at all. No, it's the not. The coronavirus don't care who. It does not it. discriminate. <laughs> She don't, <laughs> she don't care who she attacks. Okay. Mm -mm. She don't care who, who she attacks. Your she age, attacks. your race, your sex, it, it does, does not matter. matter. It does not matter with her. That's she right. She attacked in every That's way it. she can. Mm -hmm. Rich, we poor. Got to, we got to stay proud. Oh, yes. We got to be prayed mm -hmm. up. Because I do know God is coming back one day. Yes. And I mm -hmm. believe to my soul he's not too far away. I believe the same thing. He's on his I, way I really believe back. it. And he's giving us another chance. Like I he's said. He's giving us another chance Exactly. To right. He doesn't want us to perish. No, but you no. know what? God is such a gentleman. He, a gentleman, never forces himself exactly. on you. No. So he doesn't force himself. No, he he gives us a choice. So it's up to us right. what we're going to do. That's right. Exactly. It's up to, exactly. We're not perfect, and we will not reach perfection until we reach the other side. Exactly. But we, we should be preparing and working to get there. Amen. Uh, we, my God. We, we must Amen. trust it on mm -hmm. that. Amen. 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 We got to trust him. We got yes. To trust him. And we got to talk to our young girls. Oh, yes, Lord. Tell our young mm. girls what it's all about. My God. Yes, what God is all about. Mm. And like I say, go back again. Show them how to be a mother. That's right. Teach them how to be a mother. That's right. Yeah. yeah. That's right. Yeah. And you yeah. know what? Before you can be a mother, first you need to learn how to be a lady. That's right. Exactly. That's right. And we need to teach our girls how to be real ladies, how to be respectful ladies. Exactly. And then they will be that godly mother because mm -hmm. it will be instilled in them. That's right. Mm -hmm. That's right. That's right. Yeah, yeah, they need to be the mothers. That mother that's God looking for in these last days. Hey Amen, my these God. Last days, mm. they, need to, they need to do that. They really yes. need to do that. They said, uh, when a, a mother's in a home, mm -hmm. the home is going to be better. Oh, yeah. That's a mother in that home. But we got all the fathers and mothers, too. That's Have true. Oh, that? that's true. We got a lot of fathers oh, yeah. serve as mothers. In the mother's, right. yeah. Mm -hmm. yes, yeah. They serve as mothers. That's right. Too. Oh, they yes. So we have to give them credit. That's right. Yeah. Give that's them right. Credit for credit is that's good. right. Because they serve as, as mothers a mother. Too. That's right. You're absolutely mother right. That's right. That's mm. right. That's right. Well, ladies, is there anything else you all want the audience to know, the TV land to know about it? Because since this is Mother's Day weekend, and we Mother's Day weekend only come once, once a year. True. But we should serve and love mothers every, every day. day. Oh, yes. Every yes. day should be 
Mother's, Mother's Day. Day. You're right. That's right. You're That's right. Like I said, if it had not been for Mother's, we wouldn't be here. We wouldn't be here. No, we wouldn't. Be we here. Would. You know what? I just want to say to those that still have your mother, love her. Amen. That's right. You know, let her know that she's special to right. you. Right. Right. Give her her flowers while she lives, right. because once Mom closes her eyes. That's, it. That's, That's it. it. So many days I want to call mine and I, I can't. I so if mama's still living, love her. Love her. If you grandma's her. still living, love, love her. her. That's right. And be there for them. That's right. And Amen. Respect. Please respect. To all mothers. Yes. Not all yes. mothers, all women. All women. Yes, yes you Lord. Must respect them. Mm. That's right. And and young girls. Respect your elders. Please. Respect your elders. Please. Don't say in and everything around your elders. Ooh. And mm -mm. another thing, when you go out, young ladies, mm. dress appropriately. Appropriate. Don't yes. go out looking any kind of way, mm -mm. dressing any kind of way. You're not considered as being a young lady doing that. That's true. You're not. And if a guy says something to you, the first thing you want to do is say he's being disrespectful. Right. Why? Why? You mm -hmm. leave it up to him. Exactly. That's right. That's you right. Can't, the God is not oh no. Mm -mm. That's why all this stuff is going on now. True. Because That's true. Because people is too slack. We've given up the values. That's right. That's right. Like they say, it takes a village to raise a kid. Amen. But now they don't want you to say anything to the kid. But if we get back to that old, I think things will be a lot better. Yes. Go back. Go yeah. back to the basic. It's. The, the scripture is true. Charity begins at home. At home. And spreads and abroad. And spreads abroad. That's, that's right. That's right. You, that's charity is love. It and is. Mm -hmm. So, just like I said, you got to love. You got to show love. Amen. No matter what come will or may. Amen. And love is something that has to be shown. That's Amen. right. Amen. That's and right. I promise you, if you do that, You'll be remembered. Oh, as yeah. Someone that loved everybody. everybody. Right. It don't matter what came, will, or may. If you have a slice of bread and they hungry and they won't have, you give them that. Mm -hmm. That's right. Mm -hmm. And don't feel bad about it. Mm -hmm. Because one thing I know for sure, he shall supply. Amen. All your needs. Yes, he will. And he will. And and he will. And yes, he will Lord. He will do it. Yes. He will do it. Yes. And they talk about turning that other cheek. <laughs> okay. I know you oh, yeah. Lord, oh, yes. Yes. Yes, Lord. Oh, yes. Many times. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Many times. Now, where is your home church? My home church is Nichols Chapel okay. in Phoenix City. Phoenix. Mm -hmm. And your home church is? St. John Avenue Church in Fort Mitchell. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. I didn't know that. I thought yeah. you was a member of uh, Friendship. I was originally a member of Friendship Baptist Church on Highway 80, but once my husband became a minister, St. John became my home. Your home church. church. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Oh, that mm -hmm. makes a difference. Yeah. That makes a difference. So I consider myself a bat met. Yeah. <laughs> that's a good one. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Yeah. That's, yeah. that's true. Mm -hmm. You have to follow your husband. That's true. Mm -hmm. and, and husbands must love the children's mother. That's exactly. right. They must love the children's mother. Amen. Well, ladies, I am so happy to have you all here tonight. My Thank guest. you. Thank you. I just don't know how I feel. I feel so good to have you sitting between the two of you. Oh. Now, God has not call me to preach, and right. I don't think he will. But these two <laughs> preachers sitting on these side of me, I'm sitting in the, in the middle of them. Oh. God is good. Right? Amen. He, he is. is good. God, he really I, I is. You can be a witness to this fact. Yes. God God has brought us from a mind. Oh, yes, he has. Yes, yes, Lord. Yeah. And yes. He's not through with us Oh, yet. no. No, he's mm -hmm. not. He's still taking us. Mm -hmm. Oh, yes. We, day we got, by we, day. We got, we're going to go through some ups. We're going to go through oh, some downs. Mm -hmm. Yes. We're going to have to turn that up cheek. Oh, like yes. I said, but God is still with he's us. He's still there. He is still with yes, us. And I'm just so happy again. I'm just so happy to be among you all. And I want to say to you, Whenever you want to come to Bean 7, just let me know. All right. We'll be glad to have you. Well, thank you. you don't do that, just walk through the building. We'll be glad to have All you. All right. Yes, it was a pleasure being it here. Is. It's a pleasure. It was. Right. Yes, yes. And yes. this is your first time, but don't let this mm -hmm. be your last time. Mm -hmm. Okay? Yes. Okay. And 
And like I say now, we, I go and visit the churches. Right. I, I'm going to visit your church. Yes. I'm going to do that. When I say I'm going to do it, I'm going to do it. Oh, I know. I'm going to do it. Now, I've been to your church once. Are you still at the same church we came to that? Which one did you come to? The, when um, Tony and I, we came to that. She was singing at the same church. We, you know, it was two churches, so yeah. we we've, uh, went to one. Uh-huh. One now. Okay. That one went, um, they went on their own. Well, okay. they, we are still A&E. Okay. I mean, A-M-E, I'm sorry, but um, they they went on their own mm-hmm. and Hardaway, the other church, we went on. We went full time. There's still two Sundays. Okay. But we went full time. I'm full time. Full time. Good. Mm-hmm. That's yeah. a good thing. Mm-hmm. That's yes. a good thing. Well I know yes. where your one church is. Yes. Well, I don't know where the other one is. It's about mm-hmm. seventy miles away. For away from the mm-hmm. you go through Union Springs and right. then, like on twenty nine, like you're going to Troy uh-huh. to County Road nineteen, you turn it sits on County Road. Mm-hmm. Okay. Oh, yeah. well, good. Well, good. God is yeah. good. God yes, is God he is. very good. God is yes, blessed. He is. Right. Yes, he is. But I must say again, thanks so much. Thank you so much. And thank you all for being mothers. Oh, yes. The grandmothers. Yes. Thank you all for telling the mothers and the grandmothers how they supposed to live, how they should live and trust That's God. That's right. That's yeah. right. How they should love God. Because a lot of them, they'll say something they want to and, and we can't get in the churches. I know. Yet. I know. We don't. We I know. But tell them how they can watch you on Sunday morning. Well, I'm on conference call. Mm-hmm. Uh, we have a conference call, and we do a conference call Sunday school at 9 and service at 10, 15, uh, Central Time. So Eastern Time is 10 and 11, 15. So we're doing conference call right now, and they love it. Good. They love it. What about you? And we do Facebook Live, and we usually get on Facebook around 1 o'clock mm-hmm. every Sunday. Mm-hmm. Myself or either Pastor Kofi mm-hmm. will right. get on and give a message for today. Right. And... Like I said, Jones Chapel AME Church, Omega, Alabama, St. James AME Church, and Tuskegee. Mm-hmm. To God be the glory. Amen. And I want to take time to tell you Happy Mother's Day. Me too. Day. Oh, happy, Mother's happy Mother's Day. Day. Yes. Happy Mother's Day. Yes. Yes. Happy Mother's Mother Day. Day. Yes. Yes. Because yes. we're here today, but we don't know what we we're going to do. We don't know. That's right. That's know. right. Do That's know we right. We see each other right now. But That's right. That. That's I right. And may I say to TV land, I must say this again, like I say, always be blessed. Amen. And we will see you again on next week. Amen. Amen. Amen.